bro, look at this. We're going really, really hard for the final episode because we've never actually done anything like this for Beyond the Dark. Out. Out. It won't us out. Oh my f John? John. 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 John Sage. Sage he was right the torturer. Oh my god. Yo, Evil murderer. John. John. Too. John. Like John. Now that we are in King Edward's room, you guys know the history, you know how dark it is in here and the horrible things that went on at the hands of John Sage. Oh, Mike, come on! <gasps> the music box! Oh my god, oh my god! You're a John, you turn it off. Oh, Whoa! Attach. No, that's not gonna happen. Bro, you've gotta be nope. kidding me. Whoa, whoa, what the f whoa! Chillingham Castle. You guys already know what we're doing tonight. Look at these losers walking when there's a car right here. Should we hit them? We should. 50 we should points just... to Josh, 20 yeah. points to Steve. Yeah, because Josh is big. How's it feel to walk, no, loser? No, no, I'm eating you guys here. Yeah, okay, you ain't leading nothing. This is our castle. Nope, yeah. it's mine. Technically, guess what? We're the first ones in. Ha! How's it feel knowing that I was in the castle before you? Actually, to be honest, I did walk to the courtroom. Alright, we're gonna cut that. Here we go. First steps inside Chillingham Castle. Holy crap. Listen to this music. So this is our room. Look how big it is though. Oh, damn. damn. We have a rock, paper, scissors we going have a on. Oh, okay. Wait, Wait a what? Minute. It is my birthday today. That is true. Yo, shout out to Josh for having his birthday in a castle. I mean, that's a good point. Right? I mean, it is his birthday. I mean, normally the rules are a rock, paper, scissors match. Birthday normally overrules that. But if you guys want to rock, paper for it, we could still rock, paper. We can just glance at rock, paper, scissors and see what yeah. happens. Yeah, and then if we like the results, then, we can stay with it. All right, yeah. let's just see how goes there. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Oh, you oh, fool! Oh, I'm the king! Don't mess Dang with me! It. Get your ass in this room! Dang. We lost. Josh, we're losers. Josh thought it because it was his birthday that I wasn't gonna get the room. <laughs> All right guys, so this is my room for the night. Pretty freaking awesome. What I really love about it is the stone walls, everything. It still feels like you're actually rooming in a castle. It's really cool. I think the guys went upstairs. I'm gonna go and look for it. Whoa, that's a huge bathroom, Jesus Christ. So in addition to downstairs, we just have this massive kitchen area. Look at these fools. Man, what the hell? Oh, your guys' room? Yeah. Yo, is it tell me not? This is beautiful, oh bro. Look at this. God. Dude, we were just talking about tripods and we look out and see the view. <laughs> <laughs> this is the sunset and this. Yo, we're in a castle tonight. If not the most haunted castle in the entire UK. So obviously guys, as you can see, we're going really, really hard for the final episode because we've never actually done anything like this for Beyond the Dark. No, we have never not. a castle, but we've also never gone to another country to film ghost videos. Dude, I mean, look at this thing. There's cannons right here. Steve's sitting on one of the cannons. He's getting a sick drone shot, but like I'm amazed by this architecture. It's insane. How old is this? Like how oh, uh, 12th century was like 1200s. Dude, there's a secret tunnel. What is this? What lies beyond this gate? Whoa. Guys, it's beautiful, not only just because of everything that we're seeing, but it smells like fresh firewood. It smells like a fairy tale, it really does. Yeah. Bro, like I was saying, this is another Skyrim vibe. Yes. This, I feel like I just be cooking up like a pig or a chicken right now in the forest, <laughs> yeah. bro. I mean, there's even like enchanted vibes, like vines growing on the tree. Oh yeah, dude, and there's like fallen trees everywhere. Maybe this is where they get the firewood. We have fireplaces in our rooms, by the way. Guys, I was sitting here just trying to get a b-roll shot and I didn't even notice this beautiful little fantasy Skyrim looking bridge right here. You think it's safe? Do a skip across it. A skip? Yep. All right, here we go. I'm gonna skip across it's the like bridge. Skipping to the meadows. That was beautiful. <laughs> that was amazing. Check Josh's video for the other angle. <sighs> wow. Dude, this is insane. What's amazing about this place, besides the castle, is just how much they have around it. All the nature and stuff. I mean, look, this massive, huge tree next to a nice little abandoned building right here. And it's all blocked off by tree branches and stumps and stuff. So we can't even go that way. We'd have to just head up this way. We're like basically scaling the side of a cliff right now. <laughs> Bro, the tree's stopping us. Oh, crap. 
What do we do? Do we go up this way? Yeah. <laughs> if I see a spider, I'm gonna freak out and die. <sighs> we made it. We might have to, we have to go this way. Yeah. Right. What the hell? What's in here? Oh, we're in the back of the castle now. Look at that view. It's insane. Man. Holy crap, is that cannonballs? Yeah. No way. So hold up, you said that they used to like use this as like a defense against yeah, battles this, and this stuff? Yeah, this was the stronghold for the English. They would hold this place down against... and the Scottish people were trying to come and take it. Oh wow. They never did though! Oh, hey, shout out Scotland, we still love you. Think about how many English and Scottish soldiers probably died right here during a battle. Oh. Are they real? All stacked cannons. I mean, this is yeah. how it would have been. No, this is it. Yo, the, I think these are real. Yeah. <laughs> Guys. Although, it doesn't look like it fits. <sighs> Summon it right here. How did this big thing come out of that little hole? There's a cock right here, and the cannonball would come out of the cock's ass. There's just something about this. I love, dude, this is my favorite place. That's why we say the best for last. Oh, I totally agree, bro. Yeah, there's more to this, bro. There's a botanical garden we have to find. Guys, look at I the know. mountains. Hold up, let's get a little closer so you can see. Look at this little path, though. It looks like it could have been like for a horse-drawn carriage or something. You know, you would see it in like an old medieval style movie, like a carriage with a horse and maybe like a princess would be in there. I don't know, my imagination's going because I've never been to a place like this before. I don't know how much further we can walk this, but I'm gonna try to show you the mountains. If you can see it, cool. Oh, you don't want to get stabbed on here, bro. Oh, no. Not the nuts. Well, hey, think about it. If you do hurt your nuts or something, it's on video. The things we do for you guys. <laughs> like and subscribe. Thumbs up. Do it. Share the video. <laughs> Imagine if somebody that works here just saw us do that and they're already calling the cops. Whoa. No. This is insane. God, we got lion statues and the sun and the mountains in the background. I love life. I love life, bro. I don't know what those bells mean. I mean, guys, this is truly one of the most beautiful places I think I've ever seen in my life. I don't even know which way to go. I'm just walking around. I'm just looking at everything. This is freaking sick. If you guys don't know who this is, I'm pretty sure that this is Poseidon. It's also another statue over here. More beautiful plants. It's like you can just walk right up to this. Interesting. I don't know what this statue is, but if anybody does know, let me know in the comments, please. And see, this right here is just another example of how freaking beautiful this is. I mean, guys, look at that. It's insane. I don't even drink like caffeine or an energy drink, I'm doing it tonight. Yes, you are, you need it for the vid. The reason why we're chugging caffeine right now is because Josh royally screwed up. He thought we were here till three in the morning. We're only here till midnight. Isn't that right, Josh? Yeah, I was a little confused because we bought these rooms, so I also thought we could like roam, but we'll figure this out. We got it. I mean, Dan's making Steve a fire ass drink right now because Steve needs to be awake. We need this. I've already put up to there in it, so down it. Down it? All of it? Might have a heart attack, boys. There's only half of it in, half portion. How good is that? How does it feel? Black cherry. Woo! Let's go! Hold on, Steve's had a pretty workout. He's ready. Woo! Let's go, baby! Where are we going first? We're starting off in the torture chamber room. I kind of made this into a museum. There's like replicas everywhere. Dinosaur. Oh, it's a prehistoric wild pig. Yo, that thing's head is huge. Imagine if a boar came up to you that big. Probably uh, kill it and eat it. I'm sure you could kill that. Yeah. <laughs> I thought also, that's what happens when he has caffeine for the first time. Yeah, it is. Now he kill. Give him a pre-workout and he just wants to kill animals. Listen, I'm hungry. I just want to make bacon, okay? That's <laughs> it. All right, guys. Here lies the torture chamber. This guy over here is getting stretched out. I love to see it. Fun fact about this room, guys, this is the torture room and they were actually torturing English and Scottish people here at the same time. Check out the stonework right here. 
A lot of decoration that goes into just a torture room. Now guys, there's a lot of familiar torture devices in here. Like that, you know, we've seen that before. There's a cage right there, but this is the most iconic one. This is the Iron Maiden. Very great metal band, by the way. If you're not familiar with what an Iron Maiden is, basically you just stand in here and they close this on you and you get stabbed and you die. Another fun fact, this is actually supposed to depict the Virgin Mary. Not really sure how, but sure. Oh my God, there's a chopping block in here. I didn't even realize this. Either way, there was a lot of really heinous and disgusting stuff going down here. I mean, the torture was mainly because they were using it as a form of interrogation to get information out of any Scots or any English family members that they were having feuds with that they kind of wanted to settle under the radar. You know what I mean? All right, guys, quick rundown of the equipment that we have to investigate this torture room. We have the music box. As always, good old REM pod next to this poor guy. Over here we also have Dan's music box, which is probably the best one in the world. Is that a new toy? It's a new toy. We have the Alice box. This is the Ovulus's pretty much UK version, made by a guy named Andy. It only makes like five per month, so they're super rare, but if you get your hands on one, they're really cool. So in very basic terms, this Alice DNA box is just a spirit box without the static electricity. Yeah, 100%. Basically, like Josh said, it's an ovulus. It's got a word bank. If a spirit wants to give its energy into it, it can come up with any kind of word that it possibly can, and maybe we can relate it to something paranormal. By the way, the way that this works, when you see this thing turn yellow and it makes a beep, that's how you know that something's about to be said. What? Daniel? It just said my name. Oh my god, no way! Oh, it's coming for you for someone else. Wait, it's not Miles? Daniel? Include? Include. Daniel Include. I mean, I was stood over there waiting, right? So I was like, I'm gonna let you boys do it because you boys are talking about your stuff. And I thought, I'm gonna stand over there. Oh, right. And it's like, include Daniel. Include Daniel. Oh, that maybe. is kind of true. Maybe. That's that's weird. Weird. You were doing your own thing and you were down there. That's weird. It's a best the music box! Oh my god, oh my god! Box. All right, we should start the investigation like right now. I, uh, we gotta get going. Who wants to go first? <laughs> Who wants to go first for the final video? Hey guys, I'm Josh. I came from the United States of America. I don't even know if you know what that is, but if you can't tell from my accent, I'm probably different from you guys a little bit. But I came to try to talk to you and understand why you're still oh, here. Drink. Drink. But I'm not drunk if you think I drank from my accent. <laughs> <laughs> What's up guys, my name is Steve. If there's any spirits over here, just want to say that uh, we've come to your castle with permission. We're friends with the owner. Feel free to communicate with us. We would love to learn from you and know about your history. Hi, my name is Dan. Probably already know that because you did say my name for the Alice box. I mean, no harm at all. We're here in the beautiful castle to talk to you. So if there's anyone here, good or bad, step forward and speak to us, please. It's got really cold. We need some brushing through. You feel to it right oh. here. Bad. 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 And we just heard a cold breeze. And bro, it, I just said good or bad. Oh, man. You know, I'm getting a different vibe now. Yeah, me too. It's a cold breeze circular than I know. Yeah. No, it is. I oh, feel it. Oh, no, no, no. You can see our breath. Wow, it got really cold. That is Hello, my name is Seth. I'm also from the United States of America. I know you probably have no clue what that is because this place has been around since the 12th century. We're here because we want to talk to you, we want to communicate with you, and we want to learn your story, hear about your history. This place is beautiful. I'm sure some really messed up things happened here, and if something bad happened to you, then I'm, I'm sorry. Maybe we can help you if you want to talk to us. So like Dan said, any spirits, good or bad, please come forth and communicate if you wish. You need to like ask if they want us here. Alice Watts. Ruled. Ruled? Did you say ruled or world? Rolled. R O L L E D. Rolled. rolled. The torture device. device, it rolls. Oh, is that? The rolls round? Can we try just a quick, like, kind of try to talk and ask? Yeah, let's do a quick oh, burst. Out the DR6 just to see. <laughs> just okay. to see. Really quick. Let's okay. just ask questions. Yeah, I'm right. about the DR6. It's the final episode. You gotta go hard. Did you die here? Are you Scottish or English? Can you please tell me your name? Were you tortured down here? John. John? John. 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 John Sage. John Sage. John Sage. John Sage. Yeah, but they don't know about John Sage yet. But he might be here. All right, so let's talk about He was the torturer. He was the right torturer. Now. So, guys, we'll tell you a little bit more about John and John Sage later. But all you need to know is that he's very, very important to the final part of this investigation. So, please watch till the end of the video. Don't click away because that's very, very important. <laughs> I 
I definitely heard yes out of that when you were tortured here, though. For sure. Let us know what you guys heard in the comments, because sometimes it's hard for us to hear things in person. No, I got an idea. Let's leave this in the Iron Maiden and ask questions Ooh, from here. Ooh, that's a good idea. Oh, plague? Play. Oh, play. Like, like, play with me. Like, play. Or play the device. Oh, you just played it. Because you did press play. Well, I did, let's play it in here. Let me, let me drop it in here. That's Josh. He's triggering it. I'm going to leave it here. We're going to go back. Oh, music box. Oh, yeah, why is the music box so long? Go oh, remember, it did say play. If you stood there, please, can you turn it off? Move away. Now mine's going off. Whoa. You're, You're both going, going off at the same time. What the hell's going on? Manifest. 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 Are we manifesting the spirits here right now? I don't know. I have my DR60 going on too. Listen. Just want to record. Well, I feel like we're getting in the zone now and we're probably opening up like whatever. Oh, what's going on? Yeah. It's like you're stepping towards. Just to speak into it. It might be. This is incredible. I want to ask the questions to the DR60. Yeah. I'm just going to turn it off so we can ask questions. Here, holy shit. Oh, I'm going to hear it now. No, it's okay. Just when it turns off, we'll ask questions. Can you please move away? Happily. Happily? Happily move happily. away. I would happily move. Like, for oh, oh. All right, let's ask wow. questions now. Okay. There's a lot going on with the DR60. Oh my well, god. Thank that you was for moving. Oh. Are you inside the Iron Maiden right now? Correct. 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 When you ask a question. Is it for the Iron Maiden? Oh my god. Oh man. Yo, this is crazy. Can you tell us why you're in the Iron Maiden? Guys, really quick, I'm gonna go on the other side just to get another angle to show that no one's here. Oh yeah, please. Like, that's me. I just triggered that, but I'm gonna stand right here for a second. Did you die in the Iron Maiden? Can you tell us your name? How old were you when you died in the Iron Maiden? That's not me, guys. I'm not even in front of it. Can you scream help in the Iron Maiden for me? Were you Scottish or English? Do you need our help? Scared. I'm gonna go back around this side. Look at that. It's still going off. I'm gonna go get our, our DR. It's still going off. Hate. 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 No, it said wait. Oh, wait. Wait. As we, oh, I wanted to speak more. Oh my god. Wait, let's hear it. We had to hear it back then to make sure. Yeah, yeah. Bro, this could be, a, this could be the craziest one. Or I don't, I don't, I don't know. Kick it off. <laughs> this is the most consistent, like, back to back. I'm gonna turn around off the shirt. Yeah, we have to listen yeah, to this. Yeah. I'm sorry for doing that. We need to listen. Yes. Yes. So any more we sat down. Whoa, what was that? Yeah. Need help. What was Is that? that? Wait, I, it sounded like that need was help. Close. Whatever that was, it was close to it. Watch this at 255. Watch this. Kill? 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 Oh it says holy kill. No it way. It says kill. Well, I'm going back. 100%. I think it says kill, dude. Either need help or kill. Watch. Leave a comment down below. Kill. Kill. kill! kill! Okay, yeah, I hear kill now. It goes clear as day! I can't believe that. It oh, said oh. kill. As soon as I heard that, it just shivers went from top to bottom. That is intelligent evidence. Oh, 100%. The reason why we go some, because it could be one thing if the music box goes off, yeah. but then two goes off, and then it talks to us through the box, and then it goes with what you're doing, and then it goes and talks to us. Okay. It's intelligent. Explain this. All right. Why did it say kill? Probably because everyone else is getting killed in this freaking room, and they don't, obviously, they might not like us here. It said bad, and I mean, yeah, I didn't say are you good or bad, and it said bad. And right. it said English when you said Scottish yeah, or English. English. And then the Alice box also said Legion War. The Alice box has been accurate so far. This, to whole this whole trip, yeah, well, this whole castle. It's incredible because it's our first time using it. I know. I love it. I love the box. And just try to hear it. Right now, I'm going to the side. Oh! What? What? As soon as you said, "Let's turn the Alice box off," it said, "Why?" Cut. Cut. It says cut and then body. Oh! 
No. Yes. Come, no. come look at it, bro, quick. See, it literally says cut body. Oh. We're in the torture room. This All is right. the intelligent responses no. and communication that we've been getting this entire yeah. trip. No. You can't fake this! Put it down. What? What's it say? Lit. Enchant. Let, let, let chant. Enchant. Let, chant. Let, let chant. Yeah, let's yeah. chant. Let's what do we chant? We should just do harmonies. Oh. That was quick. Fire. Fire. Oh, chant by the fire. fire! The Great Hall. The Great yeah. Hall. That's Great where hall. they would have chanted and sang songs you and stuff. We need to go in there and should we go, and should we just go right now? We should. Yeah, right yeah. now. Right now. Let's go. Alright. Let's go pack up. Let's We're let's going go there. there. Fuck, I'm getting all my stuff. I cannot believe oh how God. intelligent this investigation is starting off. Bro, this was one of the best sessions I've had ever. This is some of the best evidence that we have ever gotten. Ever. 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 Okay, so we made it to the room with the fire. That was the last thing that was said to us, was let chant fire. So we're thinking that they want us to come in here, maybe investigate in the Great Hall by the fire, maybe do a chant, I have no idea. But we're gonna try a couple things, so let's see. What the hell? Yo! Hold up. Once we got inside, the lights just start flicking like this. Oh, it's so flickering. Have you had the lights flickering before? I'm not aware of them actually going out. Can you clarify that? Yeah. No one is flickering those lights. Whoa, whoa. No one is doing this right now. The light, the light switch is just going through that door. Right here, bro. All right, yes, yes. Right, dude, you got it? So no one's touching them? Look at that. That's how you turn on it off. Look at the stair. What's going on? They're actually flickering more now than they were before. Look, and now it's done. What the hell is going on? Dude, it's actually so rare for us what? to see lights yeah. flickering like that. That, that almost Bro, never happens. I have never wow. seen that happen. No, ever. me neither. Okay, guys, just to give you a quick little idea. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Look at this, dude. I've never seen lights flicker. I've seen car movies. Bro, I've never ghosted and I've lights flicker in my life. It's just crazy because they told us to come here. I know. That's I know. what they makes want me us think. The chance by the fire, bro. All the energy is here. Who knows how many people are here? I don't know. So guys, seriously, I'm trying to give you a quick idea on what's going on. We came in here because they said that they want us to chant by the fire. That's what the Alice box told us while we were in the torture room. Then we come in here with the caretaker because we just ran into him in the hallway, and all of a sudden, both of these chandelier lights start flickering out of nowhere, and then they're going on, they're going off, they're flickering on and off. So I have no explanation for what just happened. The lights are flickering and we never see stuff like that happen. Maybe like a little bit, but not frequent like that. That was insane. Enough talking. Let's just get right into this investigation in the Great Hall. Is that REM pod going off on its own? Well, I know it's not. I wasn't sure. Oh. We've got signal in here. Is someone by the stairs? So we have a REM pod here, just in case anyone comes down the stairs and wants to join us. Alice box that's about to go off. What is it going to say? Notice. Waiters. 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 But in addition to that, we also have a REM pod here and a REM pod there. So maybe we can get some people to come and sit with us. Yeah. Several. Several. Do we need several, several. chairs? Wait. I think three. we need more chairs for them. Three more chairs then. For like, spirits. Spread. 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 Oh my Spread. god! Spread. This is unbelievable! I am Spread obsessed out. with this communication right now. Yo, uh, this communication today is wild. So how do we chant? I'd harmony. say harmony. Didn't we do this before on the trip? We, we, we did we do this just, once. Are you doing Pilates, bro? What the hell? Oh. Banshee. Banshee? We're not Wait, a banshee. what sound banshee. does a banshee make? It's a howling, loud, loud pitch sound. Ah! I'm about to scream. You wanted us by the fire to chant. Is there any song you want us to, to say or sing? Did you used to cook here? Why don't you come and sit next to us on one of these chairs and speak to us by the fire? We put extra logs on for you. Do you like having us today? That's what we're doing right now. Yeah, kind of. Is there something you want us to investigate? Maybe it likes that we're investigating. Job. Job? I mean, what we're doing is, is our job. It is our job when we're investigating, trying to find more answers about this place. Who is flickering the lights? If there's any spirits in here, can you flicker the lights again? <laughs> What's, What's the flickering? flickering again? 
I got a cold breeze on my back now. I just felt it too. <laughs> really cold breeze. What I'm if we back. ask questions while the light's flickering? Okay, let's ask them to talk. Ready? Who is flickering the lights right now? Are you the same spirit that was with us in the dungeon or the torture room? Do you want us to make a chant by the fire like you asked? Do you like us being in your castle? Roses. Roses. There's roses right there, white roses. That's interesting. Edward. Edward. <gasps> Edward the First! King Edward the First! King Edward the First! Oh my f God. We already the got first. the name John. So we've got Edward John. and John now. Yeah, we, we gotta tell and them about we have oh. to just tell them about the history. Yo, I got goosebumps right now. We gotta tell them right now about well, what's going on. We have the history in another, like, way. Troop. Troop? I'm not. Troop. Oh, right. Edward and Troop. You can't make that up. No. You can't make that up. Oh my god. Legion Troop, Edward. You can't make that up. King Edward I was stationed here. He was up in the tower. Which is the most haunted place here. Because his right hand man, John Sage, stayed here. Now after the battle where they, they fought uh, the Wallace clan was it, John requested that he wanted to stay here and he became the torturer here in this castle. And we've had John's name come through and now Edward. I Are know. They, is King Edward the first with us right now? Do we ask here or do we go into the great hall and ask? Can you ask Quick. 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 If Edward is here, he's saying quick answer because he might have to He's royalty. He's not going to stick. He's not going to wait for us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's ask right now. All right. We'll record it and we'll go back to the other one after. All right. Edward, are you here? King Edward. Are you still staying in the tower room? Is your name Edward? Circle. Is King Edward and his right hand man, John Sage, in this building? In this castle with us. Do you want us to leave this castle? King Edward I, is it true that you stayed here at the top of the tower during your fight with William Wallace? King Edward, do you like us exploring this castle? Yes. 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 I heard a no. I heard I don't I don't know I what I heard, heard a no. Bill. It says fall and Bill. What happened when they returned to the tower? Why did they return? Because they beat William Wallace. Now what is short for William? Bill. It would make sense why they would be super happy because William Wallace was leading a rogue band of Scots terrorizing and taking back land from the English during the 1200s, which is when King Edward was here in yeah. 1298. This yeah. is two rooms in a row that we've investigated where we've gotten two names of people that have allegedly been here. We might as well just keep going closer. Oh my god, I'm scared to go to the tower. Oh, the hope, Tower of Terror. I hope we find John. I want to meet John. Seems like a nice he, guy. Uh, John's the worst guy in the whole I don't think John would like you. I don't think John would like you either. No, uh, John would like me. No, no he won't. I'm friendly. I get along with anyone. He didn't like anyone here. He did like torturing Except people. Except your mom. The great... <laughs> Hall. There was a fireplace in here. Also, maybe it wasn't the other room that I wanted us to go to. to maybe it was talking here. about here. Because think about it. You're here feasting, maybe having chanting, a good time, chanting, chanting. singing songs and having shanties and stuff like that. You never know. So the, it could have been here instead. Right. I think that could be just the fire, though. Yeah, guys, you know, just the, you know, picking up the family heirloom. No big deal. Ooh. Accept. They, they like our singing. They accept it. <laughs> they accepted that gift. Maybe he sees oh, his about jesters. The See what, you act like the jester. What do the jesters do? Juggle. They're a they fool. Juggle. Yeah, they're a fool. They're a clown. Josh is more... Like Tell that. jokes. What? Come on, Josh. Let's I don't know. Josh. I don't even... Your best joke. My best joke? Yeah, let's... Well, come on, what is guy. it? Come on. All right. That was it. Oh, that was pretty good. Oh, pretty good. You like that? Oh, that was you like good that? One. Did you like the joke I just do, King Edward? Uphold. Uphold. What does that even mean? Uphold. Uphold. Yeah, uphold. Yeah, yeah. Uphold. Yeah, that means that it's horrible. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's the wrong no, word. Uphold. Uphold. Oh, it means uphold. like to sustain. So, sustain. so keep doing. Keep it. doing jokes. That's it. That's the only joke I know. Just standing here. I'm a joke. <laughs> Knock knock. Who's there? Your mom? Oh. oh. <laughs> Is John or Edward here? King Edward. Right. Right. 
The flashlights are bright. Let's see what happens if we turn off all the lights. All right, we shut the lights off. It's not bright anymore. Can you help us out? Give us a sign that you're here. Maybe a thump, a knock. Murderer. 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 Oh my God. Yo, Evil murderer John. too. John. It's like John. Oh, lights, come on. <gasps> The light just goes! Oh, oh, my oh my god. Oh my god. Bro, it's yeah, like he stepped forward into us all. Yo, I'm getting goosebumps right now. John, Holy is that crap. you? Who's Holy sitting? God. If you're John, can you turn it Bro, off? Bro, it's happening today. Yo! What did you just say? If you're John, can you turn it off? Oh my god. John's here. Oh. And it just said evil murderer, and this has been going with the whole story. Exactly. Leave. Leave! Oh my god. Leave! leave. Oh my god. Why do you want us to leave, John? Out. Out. out! It oh wants us out! Oh my f I knew it. it's saying out again. It wants us out of here. Oh, he's, he wants us out, bro. bro. You want us to go to your room? I just heard a footstep on the I other side of the table. Saying, I think they're just standing there telling us to get the hell out of here. And they're right in front of us, but behind the king's chair. Alright, so do they want us to leave the castle or do they want us to leave this room? I don't know. Oh. Quiet. Quiet. So it told us to leave like multiple times, clear evidence with a flashlight. It only makes sense to go to the chapel or to the king's room. King Edward the First's room. All right guys, so now that we are in King Edward's room, you guys know the history, you know how dark it is in here and the horrible things that went on at the hands of John Sage. We're gonna get into it now. We're gonna set up all the gear that we've been using throughout the entire night. And then we're also going to do an Estes method. You're doing it. Cause I did the first one. But Josh is gonna sit in King Edward's chair. I'm ready for it as long as he doesn't kill us or scratch me. He, yeah. All right, so we'll go under, we'll see how this goes. If we get stuff, great. If we don't, we just, we'll try other ways like we've been all night. Is there any spirit or evil entity with us today? Right here with us. I'm here. Various. 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 More than one. More, yeah, more than one spirit. If you see our friend here. Eight. 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 eight people. Could be eight spirits here. But bear in mind this was a bloodshed in here. Right. He was murdered. Eight. He was murdering and killing people non-stop, so maybe there is lingering spirits here. Stage. There definitely would be multiple spirits in here, for sure. It makes sense. Can you tell us your names? John. Continue. Oh, <gasps> John. John. Oh, John Cage. This is the second time they've said his name. John Sage. It's John Sage, are you here with us right now? Huge. Huge, huge. Tall figure, John Sage, big. Ten foot. Yeah, that's right. He's it's describing guy. him. Yeah, the caretaker was emphasizing that. I'm here. I'm here. Oh. Leave. Is it true King Edward the First? Everyone. Everyone should leave. That's what I was thinking. Four. There, four there's four, four of us. us. I've got a question for you, John. Do you regret anything that you did here? Do you want to repent for your sins? Do you want to ask for forgiveness? Never. Never. Whoa. Are you sure? Now is your chance for forgiveness. Can you tell us why you did all those horrible acts to those victims? Pound. Uh, I don't, I don't like that response at all. Hell. John, it's honestly not too late to be forgiven. Not scared. I'm not asking you to be scared. I know. Wow. Do you not want to be at peace? I'm not going to allow. So you're not going to allow me to forgive you for what you've done? Never. I mean, Josh has had some really good responses. He's, he's answering some of our questions. Is there anything you want to say to us? Get out. He's been saying that all yeah. night. What do you want from us, John? What do you really want? Power. What? He wants power. Big. Big power. Experiments. Malicious. He's malicious. Did you hear him say experiments? What if he was- Evil. What if he was actually trying to become the torturer here because he wanted to like experiment on people? What if this guy was actually just like a psychopath? The grave? Are you talking about your grave? Tell us where you're buried. Where Underneath. <laughs> water. Coffin. No, not a single eight. one. It keeps saying eight. Yeah. That's gotta mean something. What does eight mean? Are you okay? Yeah, it could just be because we've been out here so long. Yeah. I don't know, I feel really drained. Steve. 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 Why did you say my name? Attach. 
No, that's not gonna happen. It will not happen. We will get the crystals out and the sage. No one is getting attached here. Could be rolling. attached to me because I feel the same ground. Focus on intention. Don't. No, yeah. see, Go. see, he's trying to get you Roll to stop. Around, bro. Roll, Roll around. around. Think about intention and set your Hell. boundaries Ooh, mentally. Yeah. You're wrong. Tough. We are not wrong. We'll not stand for that. Knock it off. No. No, we will not knock it off. We did not come here so that you, we could be your playthings. We came to communicate. There's someone walking around up there. Are you up there watching us? Up here. Oh, I've got a really bad feeling. Do we want to stop this? I don't like the vibes in this room at all. No, it's all changed. Should we pull him out? Scared. He's been in there for about a few minutes now. What do we get? You have no f idea. It was accurate. You said attach, it but one thing is for sure, it did not like when you gave the crystals to no. Steve. Because you said attach after Steve started feeling drained, so he gave him the crystals, said ground yourself, blah blah blah, and then it started saying things like knock it off, stop, don't do that. Yeah. It was saying leave yeah. Steve alone, let me attach myself yeah. to him. That's basically what it was saying. I don't know, Shit. I really feel drained. No joke at all. Maybe if I feel anything, like, any worse, I'll probably... Yeah, you probably, probably come stay with us, bro. Stuff like that's no joke. If you start feeling the way you're feeling right now, that's not a good thing. I'm okay with not doing anything else here, only because like, I don't want anything else to happen. So let's make sure that we actually cut off communication here, like right, right now, tell them they cannot follow us back to our rooms and let's yeah. get back to our rooms. Okay, I'm gonna shut this thing off. What the f Just said what the f I heard that, yeah. Right as you were about to go and shut it off. Yeah, spirits or anyone cannot follow me back home or anywhere else. And you're definitely not welcome in our rooms. That's our space for the night and you need to respect it. You are not to communicate nor affect us anymore. Including you, you John. Especially you, John. No one will be attached or affected by anything of negativity in here at all. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Yeah. Bro, you've got to be no. kidding me. What? Whoa! What is that? Is whoa! That that he has it on camera. I have it on camera. As we're gonna leave. Dude, they don't want us to leave. Look, that's too bad. We're leaving. I think we just gotta go, guys. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, what the f? What the f? Stop! Dude, no f way. Is there someone up there, like, pulling it? I don't even know someone what to say. I don't even know what to say. What the f is that? Mean? I'm, like, frozen right now. I don't we know really what to do. I don't know what to do. We need to get- No, no, seriously, seriously, let's go, let's go. That REM pod went off. No, screw that, bro. No one wants us to get out. I just- Whoa! Whoa, 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 Dude, what did you just scream about? Oh, because the tripod touched me. It scared yeah, the shit out of me. Okay, 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 but yo. Calm down, calm down. Let's, let's calm down. I mean, amazing evidence, but no, f dead. Enough. Turn the lights on. Turn them off red. It's My light's red. dead. I can't even use it. I think he feeds on it, bro. Yeah, turn off the red. We're done. We're done. We're done. Good morning, guys. What a night that was. Well, guys, we did it. We traveled the UK. We explored and investigated their most haunted spots across all the countries in the UK. It was an incredible experience, and it was something that truly made me remember why I started my YouTube channel when I was 17, 18 years old. It was just because I wanted to travel. It's bittersweet that the trip is over. One, because I'm really tired and I miss home and I want real Taco Bell again. No, but I do miss home. I miss my family and I can't wait to be back in my own space and be comfortable and just, you know, chill out for a few weeks before we hit the road again. Life is good, man. It really is. Just don't let anyone tell you you can't do anything. That's all I can really say. I was always told that I can't do the things that I want to do. And it feels really surreal and very satisfying that I'm actually able to do it, even though I was told I couldn't. We're finally out here in the UK. We just filmed an entire series, 10 videos back to back over the course of about 33, 34 days. Oh no, I've lost count of the days, but I'm grateful for the experiences that this trip has brought me. And I can't wait for the next one because the next one's coming sooner than you think, trust me. You know how it is. We always go hard for our videos and we appreciate that you guys love watching them. And if you enjoyed this video or the entire series, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Check out the homies. Let's actually go talk to them right now. Josh looks like he's just vibing out here. Steve killing it with the shots, I bet. What are you guys' thoughts about this trip? Not just this castle, but just the entire experience of being out here in the UK, making ghost videos for 30 days. I think a 30 day trip was good. I think we ran into an issue where we felt we were Superman and we could just do all of them at once. <laughs> for in, in real. 15 days. We learned a lot. Uh, this is our first ever Beyond the Dark road trip in general. So overall, this was a really good trip in my opinion. And I enjoyed it, bro. I enjoyed every bit of it. Me uh, too. We did some of the best haunted places ever. Uh, obviously day one was intense when I got scratched. In the vaults, you panicked and ran out. 
geese. Yeah, Steve yeah. Got Steve got face. scratched. It's my first time I would say I ever done a haunter trip like this. Getting to see you guys like do your stuff and just it was like unreal to me. I've never seen like so much professional equipment in my life. <laughs> and it was a lot of fun in the end. That no one got possessed on this trip. So would you say that you're a believer? Or, or do we still got some work to do? I still need some more work yeah. to do. Whole Thanks. month and this guy still doesn't believe in ghosts. I don't know what else to do. <laughs> Dan, bro, first of all, let me just say, it was nice meeting you. It was a pleasure. Bro, Glad we got to long. make videos. It's been way too long in the making. I've been watching Josh's stuff. I've been seeing you about I'm like, you know, Seth seems cool as hell. I want to I wanna hang with Seth. And here we are. Yep. Chilling in castles. <laughs> right there. Probably one of the best trips I've done. In terms of paranormal, some of the best evidence I've ever seen. A hundred percent. So what was your favorite spot the entire trip? Oh, man. You if you really had to pick one. Edinburgh Vaults. Really? Because it's on the ground. If you haven't, go and check out Dan. Freaking insane. The guy's a nutcase, really. I mean, it's crazy. Well, he's awesome. I've not killed anyone yet, so that's always a plus. Yeah, yet. Keyword. I've told you all my thoughts. I've shared everything that I possibly could about what's on my brain about this entire trip. I've shown you everything that I possibly can. I've told you everybody's thoughts. And now I'm standing on a cut down tree in front of the most haunted castle in the entire UK. I mean, you just can't make this stuff up. This is the kind of thing that I live for. I even had to take my freaking sweater off just so that I can feel this air on my skin one time before I leave this country. There's no word in any language that can express the gratitude and the satisfaction and happiness that I feel deep inside. On another note, shout out to everybody that has actually stuck with the series and watched everything. I really appreciate you. We all do. Even more of a shout out to the people that were watching our Instagram stories and stuff, trying to find us while we were on our days off out in every city. I mean, thank you guys for all the support. I love you all and thank you so much. So without further ado, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and you enjoyed the entire series, please leave a like. Consider subscribing and hit that bell button because we are just getting started. But until next time guys, be yourself and go explore the world. Peace and thanks for watching.